so th oh, like like uh, Orland said, it's not that the world of separation was wrong. It served an evolutionary purpose. It was part of a larger process, the story of separation, the separate self, that whole journey that humanity has taken. And it has reached the end of its time. A story that is overdue, that has gone beyond its time, can only be maintained with increasing effort. So for example, oil that was once available by merely pricking the ground and you'd have a gusher, now has to be forced out of the ground with fracking. Or a job, maybe you have a job that in the beginning you were so excited to go to work every day and it was fulfilling and you were growing in that job and then, and then eventually it becomes uh, stultifying, uh, it becomes oppressive and you have to try harder and harder, drink more and more coffee or be induced by a bigger and bigger paycheck to keep doing something that you know is no longer what you should be doing. Same thing for our financial system, the, our whole civilization. It can only be maintained at greater and greater cost. And eventually, the cost becomes too big compared especially to the other priorities that Orland was talking about. And at some point, this is my, my brother says this, he thinks, he's a farmer, um, and he thinks that the revolution will happen when one day the authorities, they gather together in their boardroom to deal with the new financial crisis, and here are the different options, and he says, they're just going to say, fuck it. I just don't want to deal with this anymore. I'm going home. <laughs> <laughs> and they stop maintaining it. And as soon as they stop maintaining it, it disappears. It only exists because we are continuing to tell a story that we don't believe in anymore. No one believes in it. Not the elites, which is a huge change from 30 or 40 years ago. 30 or 40 years ago, they all believed their own propaganda. But today, they don't believe it. They're completely cynical. Cynicism is a death sign. When you become cynical, that means that the heart of your world story has hollowed out and you're merely living in the superficial structures, the habits of it. It won't last. But, we, but that's not to say that we can just sit back and everything's going to be fine uh, because we can maintain it at greater and greater cost. And if we maintain it long enough, the cost will be everything beautiful. Everything beautiful on this planet. That is, will be the price for maintaining this story longer and longer. <laughs>